Hi, and welcome to Trinity's first how-to video. I hope that we'll have a how-to video every week to teach you something useful or not useful, and that you will do one of these how-to videos. Uh, so today we're going to learn how to write your name in the Russian language. So, uh, 3,500 years ago, there was no Russian language, there was no English language, and the ancestors of these languages all spoke the same language called Indo-European. And they lived maybe, you know, around Eastern Europe, above the Black Sea. And then, of course, something happened where they moved. They migrated out into Europe, into India. But we're all related. We're all uh, descended from that Indo-European language. So English is related to Russian. And uh, we're related to Hindu in India, to Spanish, all these languages. And the way that you can tell that Russian and English are related is that those, those basic first words that like a kid learns that are so basic to us, like sister and brother, they're close in Russian and English. So the word in Russian for sister is sistra which you may think sistra doesn't sound too much like sister, but it has all the same consonants as sister in the same exact order. And the vowels changed. At least one of the vowels did. Sistra, that sounds like sister, not the i. But uh, vowels change really quick in languages, in dialects, but consonants take more time. So that's one indication. And the word for brother is Brat. It sounds a little like brat, but we love brothers, and you could tell that they're related between Russian and English. All right, so the Cyrillic script that Russian is written in was developed around 900 AD, and it's used for most Slavic languages, you know, like Russian, Ukrainian. It's, it's not used in some Slavic languages like Polish does, uses our alphabet. But the Cyrillic script is used for, um, say, Uzbek language, the Turkmen language, which are Turkish languages. The Cyrillic script is even used for Siberian Eskimo languages. So it's something useful to learn. You never know what language you might want to learn, like you might want to go to live with Siberian Eskimos. And another thing you got to know is that Russians only write in cursive. I mean, there's a little bit of printing, but mostly the print is in the books, in the newspapers, magazines. But when you write to someone, you always write in cursive. So that's how we're going to learn. We're going to learn the alphabet in print, and then I'm going to show you how you write your name in cursive. Here's the Russian alphabet. A, B. Now that's the B sound. And you may say, hey, what about this? This should be B. No, that's the V sound, as in Vladimir. So A, B, V, G is the G sound. D, Y, Yo, Z. It's a ZH sound. Z. Next comes E, which is not R E, it's more like an I. E kratkaya, short, short sound E. Ka, you know what that is. L, that's their L. M, N, and that is the N sound. <laughs> Looks like H, but it's N. O, P, this is their P. R, and they have a little trill with their R. This is not a P. This is the R sound. This is S, T, U, F. This is their F. H. They don't have an H, but they have a H. Like H with clearing your throat a little. Tse. It's like a T-S. Che. 
This is a CH sound. So that's the brilliance of Russian. They, they make one letter for ch, and here's sh. They have one letter for the SH sound. And here is sh. It's like a SH and a CH together. We don't really have that in our language, but if you were to say fresh cheese fast, you'd have fresh cheese. Ch, ch. Then there's the hard sign, Tsvyorkisnak which is a vowel that goes way down in your throat. Myakisnak is the soft sign. E, U, and Ya. Toys R Us is not an R, it's a Ya sound. So here are your names. Now what you have to know about Russian is there's no J sound. So to make a J sound, they take a D and the Z sound, the ZH. So it's, this is Jean. And you might see this looks like a U, but it's the, like an I sound. This is, looks like a H, but it's their N. Jean. John. Judy, Lin, this is their capital L, it's like the I sound, it looks like a U, and the H is an N, Sandy, this is Sandy, and you notice there's a G, that's really a uh, how they draw a D sound for the little D. Daniel. This is Daniel. And it's so it's da, this H is the N and then it's E E. It's the I sound twice and the L. So Daniel. Jaina. So here's there's a little Ikrakaya to make the the E, a little different sound. Lari. It's capital L. There's two. What looks like P's are the R's. Mich. So that's the beauty. You know, you get rid of the TCH with one letter. Mich or Mitchell. Bonnie. Or Bonnie, that's their capital B. And two, two of the N sounds. Clifford, that's an impressive looking name, right? And it's these are the Fs. This what looks like a G is the D. Ashley uses the the S H, the letter they have. Maggie. For Maggie. <laughs> this is Gary. Gary for Gary. Jane. Jackie for Jackie. Jennifer. Peg. The G sound, or you could say Margaret. Margaret. Brenda for Brenda. Mary. Karen. Sally. Sharon, Cheryl, Melanie. So I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions, just write a comment. And I'm thinking there's probably some more names you might want to see in Russian. And so 
If you just send me some more names, then I'll make a real quick video of them too. All right. Thanks for listening and have a great day.